Cheap Bookies. Today we are going to go over some anticipated December releases that I am excited about. So let's get started. very excited for some of these December books and it's just a very short list usually towards the last part of the year they're not putting that many books out um, but I wanted to show some support for some books that I am highly anticipating one of them being The Cursed Crown by Alexandra Aubrey uh, um, which is the sequel to These Feathered Flames I am also really excited about Rebel of Fire and Flight um, in this one, the main character flees her home in a stolen hot air balloon. Oh my god, a stolen hot air balloon. That is, that, like, what? Um, but I am very interested in this one and I can't wait to read it. We also have Never Ever Getting Back Together by Sofia Gonzalez. We have a survivalist thriller book coming out called No Accident by Laura Bates. Um, and it's described as the wilds meet one of us is lying about seven teens who are stranded on a desert island and one who is out for revenge. Now this sounds so good. Um, I'm not really wanting to read the plot or anything like that. Synopsis, whatever you call it. Um, I'm wanting to go in blind to it, but I am very, very excited for that. I am also excited for Yesterworld, which is the sequel to Downworld. Um, and Downworld, it was kind of weird, but it was really good. Um, basically, our main character kind of found portals to alternate to an alternate dimension in her town. Um, so I'm excited to see where the sequel takes us on that one. I am also highly anticipating A Million to One, which, which is um, Adiba um, Jagadar's uh, second second or third book I can't remember um, but it gives Titanic and Ocean's 8 makeover and a heist for a treasure aboard the infamous ship that sank in the Atlantic many years ago man I'm so excited for that one and then lastly we have a really cute little um, road trip rom-com um, called Heartbreak Boys by Simon James Green um, this one it seems like it's gonna be like a really cute little summer book um, contemporary reads I can't wait to read that one and yeah, that wasn't a very long list, but again, end of the year. <laughs> There's not that many uh, books that are being released until like, you know, 2023. Um, but yeah, that is everything that I am anticipating in December. So thank y'all for watching. I'll see y'all later. Bye.